So race 37, a second here from Chattersley Corbett, the two mile three furlong hunter chase. So number one, top weight is Kluger for Stu Gray, two, Goldie for Stu Gray, Farhana Landace for James Shea is three, Glisk for Martin Needham is four, Ronquino for Obi-Wan is five, Baby Blue for Alex Cherry is six, and Lilia the Valley for Obi-Wan is seven. Starter's going to get him away here, over two miles and three furlongs. Now race him. Looks like it's going to be Glisk that's going to lead this over the first with Fahana Lendace's company. And the inside of it is now Baby Blue pushing through his Lily of the Valley, well known front runner. Himself a little bit caught for rope. Got Ron Kino in the yellow silks there for Obi Wan. And the two of the rear are Kluger. Goldie as they get to the. Oh, we've lost one. It's Glisk that's gone for Martin Leader. Unlucky. We'll be winning this one either, mate. So, so down one. The, the Valley gets to the third before anyone else jumps it well. And it is Lily the Valley that takes it up for Obi Wan. By length and a half to Alex Jerry's Baby Blue and uh, James Shea's Fahana Landace. Clued up for myself, Kino, Goldie. Pick up the six that we've got left. So we approach this nice plain one. And we'll take that well. But it's Lily of the Valley that leads us. By about three or four lengths to Fahana Landace. Slow over that was Lily of the Valley, but still maintains the lead. It's one left handed. Another 13 fences to take. So that if all six can finish, would be good. So we'll get over the six. Bit of a mistake by Goldie there, picked on the landing. Which that goes back to the rear. That's the only grey in the race. We're being led by Lily of the Valley as they just go uphill now. It's left handed again. Approach the next. It's Lily of the Valley that takes it well. Or a bit of a mistake by Farhan Landace towards the rear. Shuffles back in to join Baby Blue for a challenge for second. But it's Lily of the Valley. Comes down to the eighth. Got plenty of room. A couple of mistakes again by Goldie and Ronquino towards the rear. Be lucky if they stay on their feet. But it's still Lily of the Valley. Over the ninth. Lily of the Valley. Poison, I think, isn't it? I can't remember. But actually, one of my favourite films of all time is Lily's of the Valley. With Sidney Poitier. And he builds the church for the nuns. If you haven't seen it, it's a, it's a lovely film. But an old film, black and white. Let's get back to this race. It's Lily of the Valley that leads us here. From Farheim Landace in second. Baby Blue is third. Goldie's moved up into fourth. Kluger and Ronquino fight out fifth and sixth. But it's still the Obi-Wan series. Chill Horse of Lily of the Valley that takes him into the tenth. A little bit slower this time. Farheim Landace for James Shea has uh, gone back to join him up front. And they're about three away from Baby Blue. Goldie, Ronquino and Kluger up the rear. So we're inside the final mile now. It's Lily of the Valley and Fahim Landace that go over the ditch well together. And we've lost one this time. It's Goldie that's gone. Jockey got off before the fence. We want to take that one. So we're down to five as they come to the twelfth. It's a good job by Fahim Landace. Leads by just half a length with Lily of the Valley on his inside just pushing through. And then you've got Baby Blue of Alex Cherry that's gone round pretty sweetly. Probably do some damage as we come into the final straight. So as we come down to five, as we go over the 13th, this time a better jump by Lily of the Valley, mistake of the rear by Kluger. So Lily of the Valley just holding off Fahim Landace at the moment as they come to the 14th. It's five from home, or four from home, should I say. And it's Lily of the Valley from Fahim Landace. Baby Blue moves up in contention now, and it's these three are about five, six lengths away from Ronquino in fourth, and then a further five, six lengths back to Kluger. So they get to the 15th. They're all over it well, and it's Fahim Landace that just noses ahead from Lily of the Valley on the inside. Baby Blue hasn't asked for much yet. Running on really well now is Ron Kino, but it's Lily of the Valley that heads for home inside the three furlongs. And they come to the 16th, three from home. It's Lily of the Valley from Farhain Landes. Running on well is now Baby Blue. Still Ron Kino's in it. Running on well. Clue that we can't see. So it's Lily of the Valley inside the final quarter mile. And it's Lily of the Valley from running on well. Baby Blue. Ron Kino on the outside. Goes over the penultimate. Better jump by Baby Blue. So Baby Blue's starting to get away from it better than Lily of the Valley. And Baby Blue says go. And he's moved up a gear here inside the final furlong. The one that's going to really try and chase it there is Ronquino. He's a little slow over it. And Ronquino jumps it better and Ronquino takes it up. We're inside the last 50 metres and it's Ronquino from Baby Blue. Ronquino's going to take this for Obi Wan. Well done from Baby Blue in second. Fahim Landes got third. That's Goldie the loose horse. So a win for Obi Wan. Serious chill. 
It's himself his first hunt to chase win of the season. All done. It's him on the board. From Baby Blue of Alex Jerry in second. Third, third was Fahena Landes for James Shea. And fourth was Lydia the Valley for Obi-Wan as well. And Kluger just managed to make it round and get fifth.